What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the BTR Garage. Big video today, we're gonna to be installing our oil pan baffle on my 2022 Toyota GR86. We're gonna show you what we have, go ahead and get everything taken apart and get the baffle installed. And then in one week, we have track testing with the results. So the oil pan baffle that we're installing today is from a company called Cosma. This is the baffle right here, obviously. This one is unique from many of the others out there on the market because it has this vertical plate here down the center of the baffle. The idea behind this vertical separator here is to keep the oil on the side of the oil pickup so that the oil doesn't drain back or slosh into the other side of the oil pan under heavy cornering speeds or sliding the car around. And you'll notice this little flap here only opens in one direction. So it doesn't actually open to the left. It opens this way. but does not open in the other direction. What that does is it keeps the oil on this side of the oil pan, which is where our oil pickup is, and doesn't allow it to slosh over into the other side of the oil pan, which as we already know, results in lower oil pressure situations. I'll give you an idea real quick of how this thing works and sits in the oil pan. So basically this particular baffle is a sandwich style baffle, which means when you drop it into the oil pan like this, this would be the installed state of the pan. You can see it sandwiches between the oil pan itself and then what would be the engine up here. So once we get everything taken apart on the car and we're ready to install the pan, we're actually gonna seal this to the oil pan. So essentially put a bead of silicon around here on the oil pan itself and then drop this guy on there. Make sure that is placed properly and then we'll lift this up into the car and then screw everything in. And Cosma does provide a new set of hardware, so we'll install this as well when we install the new pan and the oil pan baffle. And as another visual reference, this is how our oil pickup will fit in the car once it's installed. So essentially the oil pickup goes through that hole and then we'll sit down in that area there. And if we flip it around, you can see the trap door down in the bottom of the pan. Try to get a closer look at that here. So enough of that, we're gonna jump into the installation of the baffle. And just a reminder, if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button down below. I would love to see you in the future. Now that we have all the boring stuff out of the way, we're going to start the process of getting the baffle laid down inside the pan. So we're going to put a bead of the Permatex black silicone on the pan itself. You'll notice we're going around the holes to the inside of the oil pan and then basically run the bead from hole to hole. So we'll drop in the Cosima oil pan baffle, press it down into place, try to squeeze out some of the silicone. Then we're gonna grab our Permatex again and lay another bead hole to hole, again going around the holes to the inside. This is gonna be the seal that obviously seals us up to the bottom of the engine block. We'll wipe off the engine block side one more time and then we kinda of have to put the pan in backwards and then twist it up into place. That's the only way to get it to go in when the baffle is installed in the pan. We'll line up our holes, make sure everything is straight Give it a good press into place. And then we're gonna put a couple of bolts in there just to hold it in position. And then clean out the bolt holes of any silicone that might've gotten stuck up in there just so it doesn't jam up into the bolt hole. Then we'll reinstall all of the bolts by hand and then snug them down with the tool before finally torquing them to 57 inch pounds with the small torque wrench. And we'll jump back into the time lapse and put everything back together. All 
All right, everybody, that's gonna wrap it up for this installation video for the Cosma oil pan baffle on my GR86. Remember, the testing is one week. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to get the updates on those results as soon as they come out. And like always, I hope the video was helpful. If you have any thoughts, comments, or questions, please leave them down below. I would love to hear from you. Stay safe out there. I am checking out. We'll talk to you all next time.